I always wanted to paint since I was a little kid. But um, my dad wanted me to be a piano player. He, was a, he loved classical music. Dr. Arnold Gonzalez is one of the most unique artists in South Texas. That's because his day jobs have included being a teacher, state lawmaker, and city councilman. But his accomplishments on canvas have been so impressive that his work is highly valued. And one of the reasons that the Corpus Christi Symphony and Orchestra asked him and several other artists to turn a plain old violin into a true work of art. He did just that, and you can see he focused on the conductor. Can you imagine having to write the instruments for all those individuals? These guys are Mozart and, and all, the, all the great uh, conductors. Gonzalez works out of the living room of his home, and that's where we met up with him and his fellow artist, Guy Morrow. Morrow also was charged with making a violin into something people would want to spend thousands of dollars on. He gave us some insight into his creation. And by having the tom uh, strut with this fan out, that tells you it's in April. So then I, I let things go from the ground to the sky. And in the sky, I actually picked the moon phase of April the 3rd. On Friday, the Corpus Christi Country Club will be hosting a fundraising event where these violins, along with three others, will all be auctioned off to the highest bidder. We have a lot of people that are excited to come and see these violins and uh, do some bidding. And so, you know, any money we can raise for the symphony is great. So if you'd like a one-of-a-kind violin like one of these, the Painted Violin Extravaganza starts at 6.30 on Friday, and the symphony is selling tickets up until 5 p.m. on Thursday. Michael Gibson, 3 News.